A fuming pedophile hunter mob launched into an expletive-laden rant against a BBC reporter after he showed up at one vigilante's home with a cameraman asking for an interview. Reporter Kevin McGee was confronted by the irate pedo hunter and his gang, accused of harassment. Mr. McGee had previously visited the man's home, asking him, who gives you the authority to go and hunt for people you think are pedophiles? The pedophile hunter repeatedly refused to answer questions and told him to leave, calling him a disgrace to the BBC. But the pedo hunter later learned of Mr. McGee's whereabouts, taking him by surprise as he was buying coffee in Belfast last night. The ugly confrontation filmed on a mobile phone and streamed live to Facebook shows the pedophile hunter approach Mr. McGee and two of his colleagues inside the shop. He asks, how does it feel to be confronted? You don't like this, Kevin, do you? A security guard can then be seen coming between them and leads the shaken reporter out of the cafe. The man holds his phone up to Mr. McGee's face and says, this is the closest you will get to any of these groups, do you understand? You came here tonight thinking you were gonna get stuff on me. You better watch your effing self. He follows him down the street, saying, you stressed me out this morning in my family effing home. You have no idea of the stress you've caused. Why you ever come near my house again, I swear to God. Do I make myself clear? Several people can be heard yelling at the reporter as they surround his car. The group then continue to shout obscenities at the reporter as he is escorted to his car by bodyguard. I am no longer a pedophile hunter, I run an online child safety awareness program called SafeBook. This man, as a result of me blocking him from getting any comment from any other hunting group due to him going to the home of a female hunter and causing undue stress and alarm, then saw fit to come to my home. We are unable to provide further comment at this time. A PSNI spokesman said, police are aware of the footage from last night's incident. It will now be reviewed to establish whether any offenses have been committed. We pay for your stories. Do you have a story for The Sun online news team? Email us at tips at the sun.